Hey guys, what's up? It's Missy Atlanta and I have a Dollar General haul for you guys today. Something like a coupon failed haul. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> okay, but this is what I ended up picking up in my first transaction. If you watched my previous Dollar General um, kind of like preparation haul showing some of the 5 off 25 um, deals that you could do, then you will know that my transaction has been almost completely altered. So with that being said, I picked up two of these Cottonelle um, 12 double roll packs of tissue. And these are ringing up for, they're $7, you guys, $7 each. Then I also picked up here in the middle, you see the Kleenex. I picked up four of those. Those are $1 each. Then you see I picked up the Snuggle twin double pack of refills for $5 and one of the U by Kotex 18 count super plus tampons. The Continental and the Kleenex are included in a spend deal at Dollar General. A spend deal is where you spend a certain amount of cash and you receive a certain uh, amount back and reward. So it was on a spend 15, receive $2. So I did that spend deal. I also included all of these items into the 5 off 25. So I had to spend a total of a minimum of $27 because when you do the 5 off 25, you have to add on whatever is from the spindle, if that makes sense. So the 5 off 25, I have to spend $25 for the, to receive the $2 off the spindle, I need to spend $27. So hopefully that makes sense. But anyhow, my deal didn't go quite as planned. So yeah. I was trying to figure out why my total, as you can see here, ended up being fifteen twenty-five. Focus, fifteen twenty-five instead of twelve. Well, the <laughs> the UI Cotex digital coupon, although it was showing that it was attaching, it did not attach when I checked out. So I also had altered a lot of different things, you guys. This transaction is a little bit confusing. Let me just show you guys what I have. You can preview my previous video to see what I was planning to purchase. The cotton nail, of course, was $7, and then you see the discounts and everything coming off. At the end, I ended up paying basically $7 for both. Um, it was like $6 and something, and hopefully I took a screenshot of that for you guys, and I will show you later. But you can see here the dis the digital coupons coming off the store discount from the five off twenty five the two dollar off of two cotton nail and then here you go see another store discount then you see the Kleenex coming off then I use the manufacturer coupon for a dollar off of four the um, Coltex is where you see. My coupon, oh wait, the $2 coupon did come off. I have to relook at this transaction, you guys. So it's $325. What is this? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> and I'm not going to hold you guys up. And then the renews it, the snuggle renews it. That was $5. I used a $3 off because the one for $3 that would have been absolutely free was not available. Um, the big razors that I plan to pick up were not available. Not the $2 or the $3 razors were not available. Um, so that is the reason why I had to kind of switch my deals and everything around because a lot of things weren't available, etc. and whatever. But, um, yeah, still not too much of a bad deal. $15 and 25 cent for these essential items and not too bad. Let's move on to the second transaction. Maybe that's a little bit better, but still some failures.
Okay guys, so on to transaction number two. And this transaction is something like a glitch failed. <laughs> so I mentioned in my previous Dollar General video about a Werther's Original glitch. Um, of course this glitch has worked for several people, but of course it did not work for me. So let me explain. Um, as you see here, you see 16 packages of Werther's Original. At Dollar General, the Werther's Original are $1 a pack. So that would be $16 you see right here. Then they are buy three, get one free. So I did that deal four times. I only used three coupons because I was testing out the glitch, which is you scan two, scan the coupon, scan two more, scan the coupon, scan two more, scan the coupon, then you scan all the rest of your packages. And for most people, that is coming out to be like a penny a package. Yes, one penny. But for me, nope, 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 nope. That's not quite how it worked out. So I will get into that a little bit later when I break down my receipt. All right, so I picked up four of these U by Kotex pads, and these are the 22 count um, regular pads. These are 325. Um, so I picked up four of those and I used four $2 off one paper manufacturer coupons. Then I did two spin deals, you guys, two spin deals. So the first spin deal I did was on the degree. I picked up one of the men's degree twin packs. In the Cool Rush. And these are $4.50. And then with the 5 off 25 and the spindle that I did, it took off an additional 56 cent and an additional $1.41. So for this uh, package at the end, once I break down the receipt, it was around about $2.53. Then I also picked up this degree here. And these are $1.85. Um, with the spin deal and the five off 25, it took off an additional 23 cent and an additional 59 cent, making this about a dollar and three cent. And you can get the men's degree as well. So the spin deal with the degree is spend, is it spend seven? Yeah, I think it's spend seven, receive $2. So I did that deal. And then I also did the Suave spend deal, which was uh, spend $7 on Suave and you receive $2 back. So since I needed to stock up on deodorants, I went ahead and picked up just seven of the $1 deodorants. Um, yeah, so they were $7. And then I did the spin deal, so I received two dollars off for that. And then for each one, I received an additional forty-one cent off because it was an additional thirteen cent and an additional twenty-eight cent. So that brought each one of these deodorant, the Suave deodorants, down to around in about fifty-eight cent each. So I picked up three cents. I picked up the Tropical Paradise, which we have tried before. I picked up the Standard Powder Fresh. And Dollar General had Coconut Kiss, which I've never tried before. So I picked up three of the Coconut Kiss and two of the others. And yeah, so 58 cent for deodorant is definitely not a bad deal. $1.25 for the Coltex. And then let's get back to the Werther's original. Oh 
Okay, you guys, so the struggle is real. The struggle is definitely real, but let's get off into this Werther's original deal. I tried the glitch and it was definitely an epic fail for me. So I'm gonna tell you guys what I should have done just in case you want to do the deal. I should have picked up eight bags at $8 and did the buy three, get one free, taking off additional $2, bringing that down to six. I should have used four coupons instead of three, bringing that down to $2 or 25 cents per bag. Then the deal would have been, you know, a little more pleasable, if I should say. But anyhow, what's done is done. And yeah, so I'm going to go on to show you guys um, the receipt, review that, and then yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, so let's review the receipt for transaction number two really quick. Um, and this first up here is the twin pack of degree for $4.50. You can see the store discounts coming off for $0.56 cent and $1.41, making the twin pack around in about $2.53. Then we have it here at the $1.85 is the individual degree. Um, and you can see the $0.23 cent and the $0.59 cent coming off. So that made that degree about $1.03. So then we're going to move down and you start to see the suave deal that we have. So this is going to be done seven times. You see the suave for $1 and then you see the uh, store discounts coming off for $0.13 cent and for $0.28 cent each. And that is done seven times. And then one of them received a little bit more off, um, $0.12 cent and $0.32. Cent. Then we have the U by Coltex here. These were three dollars and um, twenty-five cent. The store discount took off twenty-two cent. Manufacturer coupon for two dollars. That made them about a dollar and three cent as well. I'm um, going back up to the swab deodorant. Those were about fifty-eight cent each after all discounts apply. So now let's get down here to this. Worthers. So the Worthers, you see, they're all a dollar. I had a ring up too, so you see a dollar, a dollar, and then you see a manufacturer coupon for a dollar. And then you see that uh, repeated. You also see an additional 18 cent coming off, and then you see all of these 18 cent, 18 cents, one dollar, 18 cent, and my high out of pocket. So I really wish that I had done this transaction differently, you guys, um, but I didn't. So it is what it is. We live and we learn. Um, I hope that this video was helpful for you guys or to someone as always. And yeah, I'm going to see you guys and talk to you in my next video. It has definitely been a hassle. <laughs> To say the least, um, I did receive another coupon for next Saturday. Next Saturday, I think I'm going to try some um, baby deals, maybe. Um, we'll see what coupons they have that come out or whatever, or if I do anything. But yeah, so I will see you guys, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye. Before you go, I did scan my receipt into Fetch Rewards. So if you guys want to download Fetch Rewards, use my code AK58D. Scan your first receipt and you will receive 2,000 points, which is equivalent to $2. So yeah, guys, make sure you guys are saving as much money as you can every way that you can.